A cod or a gade cuneiform, URIKI was the name of a Mesopotamian city and its surrounding area. Akkad was the capital of the Akkadian Empire, which was the dominant political force in Mesopotamia during a period of about 150 years in the last third of the 3rd millennium BC. Its location is unknown, although there are a number of candidate sites, mostly situated east of the Tigris, roughly between the modern cities of Samarra and Baghdad. Textual sources Before the decipherment of cuneiform in the 19th century, the city was known only from a single reference in Genesis chapter 10 verse 10 where it is written Akkad, Akkad rendered in the KJV as Akkad. The name is given in a list of cities of Nimrod in Sumer Shinar. Soliberger and Westenholz cite the number of 160 known mentions of the city in the extant cuneiform corpus, in sources ranging in date from the Old Akkadian period itself down to the Neo-Babylonian period. The name is spelled logographically as Uriki, or phonetically as Agad Deki, variously transcribed into English as Akkad, Akkad or Agade. The etymology of the name is unclear, but not of Akkadian Semitic origin. Various suggestions have proposed Sumerian, Hurrian or Lullabian etymologies. The non-Akkadian origin of the city's name suggests that the site may have already been occupied in pre-Sargonic times, as also suggested by the mentioning of the city in one pre-Sargonic year name. The inscription on the Basetki statue records that the inhabitants of Akkad built a temple for Naram Sin after he had crushed a revolt against his rule. The main goddess of Akkad was Ishtar Astarte, Anana, who was called Astar Anunatam or warlike Ishtar. Her husband Alaba was also revered in Akkad. Ishtar and Alaba were later worshipped at Sippar in the Old Babylonian period, possibly because Akkad itself had been destroyed by that time. The city was certainly in ruins by the mid-first millennium BC. <laughs> <laughs> Location Many older proposals put Akkad on the Euphrates, but more recent discussions conclude that a location on the Tigris is more likely. The identification of Akkad with Sippar Sa Anunatam, modern Tel Ed Dur, along a canal opposite Sippar Sa Samas, Sippar, modern Tel Abu Habba, was rejected by Unger, 1928, based on a Neo-Babylonian text, 6th century BC, that lists Sippar Sa Anunatam and Akkad as separate places. Harvey Weiss, 1975, proposed Ashan Miziat, a large site 5 kilometers 3.1 miles northwest from Kish excavations have shown that the remains at Ashan Miziad date to the Ur 3 period and not to the Akkadian period discussion since the 1990s has focused on sites along or east of the Tigris Wal Romana 1990 suggested a location near the confluence of the Diyala River with the Tigris, and more specifically Tel Muhammad in the southeastern suburbs of Baghdad as the likeliest candidate for Akkad, although admitting that no remains datable to the Akkadian period had been found at the site. Soliberger and Westenholz 1999 suggested a location close to the confluence of the Adhayam River east of Samara at or near Duluia. Similarly, Reed 2002 suggested a site in this vicinity, by Kadishia, based on a fragment of an old Akkadian statue now in the British Museum found there. This had been suggested much earlier by Lane, based on an old Babylonian period itinerary from Mari, Syria. Akkad would be on the Tigris just downstream of the current city of Baghdad. Mari documents also indicate that Akkad is sited at a river crossing. See also Cities of the Ancient Near East History of Mesopotamia